Well, today marks the start of Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and right now there's an effort to get women screened for the disease in Virginia Beach. It's the annual Surf for the Cure event with Coastal Edge. Yeah, new at noon, Casey Baylor found this event has helped women detect cancer early in the past and is a big resource for the community. Blair Daniels says her friends convinced her to get a mammogram at the Coastal Edge Surf for the Cure clinic three years ago. Peer pressure. I've always worked this event with the Wahine Surf Club and peer pressure. They're like, oh, you're 40. Let's, you should go and get your free mammogram today. She got tested that day on the mobile bus, something she says she probably would have scheduled another time. Luckily, she didn't. What I did realize is that that very, that was on a Saturday. On Wednesday, I got a call back and they said, you need to come in for more imaging. And I was a little shocked being just turned 40. Doctors ran more tests, and after several visits, they found a benign tumor. I am very, very thankful, but also realize how important this is. Surf for the Cure coordinator Amy Rhodes says that's what it's all about. We are very happy and fortunate that we have been able to help Four that we know of, it could be more. About 24 people are scheduled Friday for a screening outside Coastal Edge in Virginia Beach. It's the eighth year Surf for the Cure and Chesapeake Regional Healthcare partnered on this effort. And this should be um, important to everybody. Early detection will help in your process of treatment. It's free even if you don't have insurance. Surf for the Cure is also hosting a skating and surfing contest this weekend, along with other events. Money donated will help eight breast cancer patients. Surf for the Cure! In Virginia Beach, Casey Baylor, 13 News Now.